welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be another home decor haul. I have no excuse. I have no excuses. I've been shopping like crazy because as you guys probably know we moved into our house and we've been here for about two weeks or three weeks? Yeah, about two weeks, like two and a half weeks. Because moving from a one bedroom apartment to a three bedroom study loft house it's kind of a lot to furnish so I've kind of just been buying little stuff here and there to decorate and yeah so I have a lot of good stuff to show you guys and if you guys are new to my channel please make sure you hit that subscribe button down below my name is Lori and I would love if you guys would subscribe to my channel I talk about home decor, organization, budget, I do marriage videos. So please feel free to subscribe if you like those type of videos. I would appreciate it and I would love if you would be a part of our graceful and lovely family because I love you guys so much. And yeah, so let's get started. Okay, so the first store I want to get started with is going to be World Market. I bought a couple of more things from there. You guys already know my obsession. I love World Market. World Market, if you see this, let's do something because I love World Market. You guys are amazing and I, I just love that store. So the first thing I want to show you guys, it's a little bit too big to put in here. I can't even carry it. It's legit like 100 pounds. So they had a crazy good deal on this outdoor patio set and I really wasn't in the mood to spend a lot of money because we've been spending so much money with this house with a down payment and closing costs and all that stuff. So we really didn't want to pay a lot of money for an outdoor set, but we do have an amazing outdoor area, which is probably the reason why we bought this house. We just fell in love with the scenery, but we haven't gotten any furniture to put out there to enjoy it. So when we saw this online, I saw it first on worldmarket.com and it was $1.99. It comes with like a coffee table and a bench and two chairs. And for $1.99, I was like, what the heck? This is amazing. So I showed it to my husband, I go, I showed him a picture and I said, how much do you think this costs? And he said, around seven, eight hundred dollars, which is what I thought too. And I told him the price and he's like, get that right now. Get it, get it, get it. We both have been talking about having our breakfast out there in the patio and enjoying the view, but we just never had any furniture. So he was like, get it. And I was like, all right, let's do it. So I'll put a picture right here of what it looks like. It is very simplistic, but it's perfect. I absolutely fell in love with it. I fell in love with the price. And I had a coupon on top of it, so it came out to be really, really affordable. And for a patio set, you guys, if you guys have a house or you guys furnish your outdoor space, you guys know patio furniture is no joke. It's expensive. So I was like, World Market saves the day again. And we got it, and I'm so excited. It's right there in my hallway in a box. It actually got delivered today. But yeah, we were excited to set that up and start enjoying our breakfast out there. And yeah, so that was the first thing I got from World Market. So the next thing I got from World Market is this adorable tea storage. I love this box. It's so gorgeous. It is a clear glass storage and it's very, it's copper rose gold kind of color. And you open it, if I can open it, there you go. And it's just really, really pretty. So you just put your little tea packs, tea packets in here. And I thought it was a really pretty way to display your um, your tea. I think it's adorable. And this was only $19.99, but it was on sale for $14.99. And it's pretty large, if you guys can see it. It looks kind of small online, but it's actually pretty large. And it can fit a lot of tea packets. So I really, really like this. So the next thing I got from World Market is this glass drying rack. But I'm actually going to use it for my coffee mugs. I've seen this all over Pinterest and Instagram and I think it's adorable and putting my coffee mugs on here to display them would look perfect. So this is $14.99 at World Market. So the next thing I got from World Market is a Lazy Susan, but it's not just any Lazy Susan, it's a very stylish one and it looks like this. It is a marble top and I just love it. I feel like it's going to be so cute and I'm actually using this for my closet. I'm going to store all my um, perfumes on top of here and yeah I just thought it was really cute and this one was $14.99 and you guys this is really heavy like I'm carrying it right now and it's it's at least three four pounds and it's a very good quality for $14.99 you won't find this anywhere else for $14.99 so definitely go check it out and of course like I always do I will link everything down below oh my gosh I can't even carry it with one hand <laughs> I'll link everything down below so you guys can buy this and yeah I just love this but the next store I went to, I went to Walmart, and you guys already know, I'm a Target girl. 
but the only thing I buy at Walmart is the Pioneer Woman. So I got a couple of more goodies from her. She actually has a new collection out and it is so adorable. It's very floral and ugh, florals. I love florals. So I went to Walmart to get these um, specific placemats. They were so pretty. So let me show you guys how they look like. So this is what they look like. Oh my gosh. They are floral and gorgeousness. I love the vintage look of these. And I bought six of these because I'm crazy like that. Even though we really only have room for four. But I wanted six just in case. And I just love it. And they're actually reversible. So the back is really cute too. And I just love, I love this. And I've been looking for the um, kitchen towels of this design, but they never have it at my Walmart. So I think I'm just gonna end up biting the bullet and ordering it online because I really want the kitchen towels for these. They're so cute. Oh, and the price, darn, I don't know what the price is. I will look it up online and I'll link it down below for the price because I'm, I'm really not sure, so. So the next couple of things are just some kitchen utensils. So I got this a slotted spoon and this is what it looks like and then a basting spoon I don't even know these names I don't even know those basting or slotting or slotted all I know is that they're cute <laughs> and this is a basting spoon and I also got this slotted turner which is what this looks like I call it a spatula it's actually a slotted turner but look how adorable these are I love this it's gonna look so good in my kitchen and once I paint my cabinets white, it's going to look amazing because we do plan on painting the cabinets white. I'm just kind of terrified to do it because it's a really dark color. And I'm not trying to pay some cabinet dude to come in here and charge us like $5,000. We'll do it ourselves. I'm just a little nervous, but I'll get around to it eventually. I'm thinking this summer I'll get the courage to do it. <laughs> but until now, I got to deal with the black uh, cabinets. And I know a lot of y'all love the black cabinets, but I don't like black cabinets. I or the darker cabinets. I just feel like it darkens the space too much and I just like white and airy and bright. So yeah. So you guys already know I can't do a home decor haul without Kirkland's because lately that's all I've been talking about, right? So I only bought like three things at Kirkland's, which isn't too bad, but they're adorable. And they're wall decor, of course. But the first thing is this, um, this wall decor piece. I love this. So it just says, we love because he first loved us, John 4, 19. And I thought this would be perfect to put in the entrance above our door. I just, I love this. It's perfect. And it's a perfect reminder when we leave, you know, just to be grateful and be appreciative of everything God does for you. And I just feel like it's important to have reminders all over your house, just talking about God and just reminding you to appreciate life and appreciate your blessings no matter where you're at in life know that god's always there and yeah so i love buying these pieces from kirkland's because they do that for me they inspire me they motivate me and they keep my faith strong so this was 14.99 at kirkland's and for the size it's huge for 14.99 it's amazing I'm trying to get it on the frame <laughs> so yeah that's that so these next couple of things from kirkland's are actually my favorite things from the whole haul because they're so adorable so this is just a little small wall decor that I'll probably put on my, um, a, in a bookcase or something like that, but it's just so cute. It's floral with gold foil, amazing font, and it's inspirational. <laughs> like it doesn't get better than that for me. So this is what it looks like. And it says, have patience, God isn't finished yet. It's so pretty. I have these all over Kirkland's and they're probably just to put on your desk or in a bookshelf and just have a, a good little reminder you know so this is one this is $7.99 and then I got another one and this one is amazing so this one says when I am afraid I will put my trust in you Psalm 56 3 and again it has the florals and the gold foil and I just thought it was adorable and these were $7.99 but they were on sale for $4.99 so I just think together they look so cute let me see if I can there you go so they are so cute together. So these are just perfect reminders to have in my office and I'm going to adore how they look once I organize my office, which is still in the works. <laughs> but I will be showing you guys how I decorate with these soon. So lately I haven't really been finding a lot of good things at Home Goods, but I found a couple of things this time around. So the first thing I got at Home Goods were these file folders and they're floral and watercolor, which 
you guys already know watercolor florals that's just my thing and these are $5.99 and it has nine file folders and I think they're adorable and they're going to be perfect to organize my office with. The next things I got from Home Goods were these wire baskets. These were $5.99 and I bought three of them. I will be doing a organization video with these soon. So they're a good size and when I buy baskets, I always buy in three. I just like the way three looks. Um, but these were $5.99 at Home Goods. Okay, the next thing I got at Home Goods was this really adorable frame. This one was $5.99 at Home Goods, and this is what it looks like. It's a very kind of rustic matte black frame, and I thought it was really pretty. I love the Victorian styled frames. I just love anything that's French Victorian, and I thought this was really cute since so it was $5.99. And this one is also $5.99, and this one is this was more of a classic traditional frame. It reminds me of like the olden days as well. And this one just says smile often, which I probably will change this out and put a picture. But it's this rose gold kind of copper color. And I just thought it was adorable. So that's that. Well, the next store I went to was TJ Maxx. I didn't get that much stuff from there. But this box is enough to show you guys. This box is perfect. And I'm looking for more of these boxes. But I can't seem to find them. But I'm going to keep looking. But this is what it looks like, guys. Can we just have a moment? And appreciate the beautifulness of this box it has um, a white background with black polka dots it has rose gold um, foil lining it has florals all over just floral all over it has white and pink polka dots inside and look at the front of this box it has gold foil it's more like rose gold rose gold foil it says dreams need hustle and it has florals oh i fell in love with this box my husband saw he's like that's so you baby and i was like it is so this was a tj maxx and this was 6.99 and i just want more of these boxes because they're so pretty but yeah i really really like this box so the other things i got from home goods were just some notepads this is a uh, 2.99 and it just has a it's a mint green color with um, white lettering and I thought it was adorable and this actually honestly okay this probably is my favorite thing out of everything I have been looking for something like this for a long time and it was bent a little bit and I was kind of down about that but at the same time I just felt like it was completely worth it and this is my daily bible verse journal 365 pages full of art and scripture and it just has scripture it has scripture and it has beautiful um pages like this I just love this like I probably will like cut some of these out and frame them I just think they're adorable and I mean it just doesn't get better than this it's just oh my gosh it's amazing and this was a TJ Maxx which I was really shocked so this was $5.99 but it's such a good deal and I just I, I adore it so I was really excited about this so the next couple of things are from Ross and I had stopped going to Ross for a while I just I didn't have luck finding anything like I used to before and the, the I don't want to say the quality is cheapy compared to other stores but it's I just started feeling like the quality of Ross isn't as nice as a Marshalls or TJ Maxx or Home Goods or Kirkland's so I kind of stopped going there but on a whim we went there randomly and I found some good stuff so yeah I'm really glad they elevated their game because they were slacking for a while so the first thing I got from Ross was this really cute uh, wooden box it's very simple, it's nothing special really, but I just love finding little knickknacks like this to put on a bookshelf to decorate with. And this was $8.99, but it just looks so old school and vintage, and I love the way it looks. Because I like white, crisp, airy stuff with touches of color and wood. That's just what my style is. So when I saw this, I was like, this is perfect to put in a white bookcase. And I just liked it. So this was $8.99. This might be kind of random, but since I've been a little, I've always liked the Asian culture, the Japanese, Chinese, um, just like, I don't know, their culture is amazing to me. How they dress, you know, the little traditions they have. I just love it. My mom has a china cabinet that's like hand painted and it's just beautiful. It's beautiful. I love it. And when I saw this, it reminded me of that. And I've always wanted a piece like this for my home. And it's a little bit big, but I'm still going to show it to you guys. And this is what it looks like. It's just a really beautiful um, vase. So this is hand painted by skilled artisans using the traditional centuries old technique. And I just, I love it. I fell in love with it. This was 
and I just felt the cobalt blue pop of color was amazing. I love cobalt blue. So if your style is very neutral like mine and you're looking for a pop of color, cobalt blue is the perfect pop of color. I think it's adorable and it's going to look amazing. So yeah, this was $14.99 at Ross. So the next thing I got at Ross is just a picture frame. I've been kind of going crazy with picture frames. I know you guys have seen like a five picture frames in every haul, but I always look for wooden picture frames. And when I saw this one, I thought it was really cute. This was $5.99. It's an eight by 10, so it's a little bit larger, but I really like the finish of the wood on this frame. So I picked it up and I love it. So this was $5.99 at Ross. So the next thing I got at Ross was this tray. I thought it was so cute. And I wasn't expecting this to be so cheap. I thought it would be at least $14. It ended up being $6.99. That's why I love Ross, because the prices at Ross are so cheap. And it just has some jute rope and chalkboard, a chalkboard backing and just wood. I thought it was really cool. And I love the shape of this. It's very different than your traditional rectangular tray. So I thought it was really cute. And yeah, so this was $6.99 at Ross. So the next thing that we picked up is actually my husband's. This was what he chose. Um, he's been looking for accents for his office to decorate with and he picked up this rock He thought it was so cool and it is really cool It's a really pretty blue color and it has little hints of brown and it's just really gorgeous And then like every single side is amazing and this was made in Brazil and it was $11.99 and it's really heavy But yeah, this was really really cute. So the next thing is this huge box that I picked up it is just a whitewashed um, basket and I loved it. It's huge. I was looking for more but they didn't have any and this was $9.99. So this is what it looks like. Okay, so the last thing I got from Ross is beautiful. It is actually a wall art and it's pretty huge but this is what it looks like. So it is a gorgeous floral painting and I loved the colors of um, the flower that they use. It's a beautiful fuchsia pink hot pink color. And then it has a really pretty gold foil on it. And I just thought it was adorable. This is definitely going into my office. And this was $14.99. Ross wall art is so cheap. It's so affordable. So if you guys are looking for wall art, definitely check out Ross because their prices are really good. Because this probably would have cost $24.99, $29.99 at Home Goods or TG Maxx. So this is really pretty and I'm going to decorate this in my office. I'm so excited. Sorry if I've kind of been rushing through it. I just feel like there's a lot of stuff and I don't want this video to be like 30 minutes long. So that's probably why I've been rushing through it. But this next thing I'll sit back and talk to you guys a little bit about. I have been wanting this for a very long time and I'm a very frugal person. I am cheap to the max. I don't like spending money. <laughs> like I don't like spending money at all really. And I always find ways to save money. I literally just spent five hours upstairs budgeting the bills and trying to see how we could save money like I do that all the time and my husband's always like everything's auto paid I'm like I know but I want to see if I can try and get it cheaper try and save money somehow and yeah that's how I am so this thing is actually pretty pricey and I've been wanting it for a while probably since the beginning of our marriage ever since I became like a wife I felt like every wife should have one of these because it's just the wifely thing to do and I finally found a really good deal on it that I felt I could stomach because <laughs> I really don't want to spend $200 or more but um, Kohl's was having a really good deal on this and I had to pick it up so let me show you guys what it is some of you guys may already know because if you guys follow me on snapchat I talked about it and this box is empty because it's really heavy but it's a KitchenAid mixer it is a KitchenAid mixer it is a white KitchenAid mixer and I was so excited to finally purchase this. I haven't used it yet, but I plan to soon. And I am in love with it. I'm excited to have this for the holiday season and make cakes and do all types of stuff. And it's just, I don't know, it just, to me, it makes your kitchen whole. Maybe that's just the way I feel, but I just feel like it brings the kitchen together. So I'm really, really excited that I finally bought one. And of course, I will link it down below. So yeah, I finally, bit the bullet and got me the KitchenAid mixer and I'm really excited about it. So yeah, and maybe I'll be shooting some more recipe videos with this bad boy because I do love to cook and bake. But if you guys are into recipe videos, give this video a thumbs up or make sure you leave a comment down below and let me know if I should do recipe videos. I would love to hear from you guys. So that's all for this video, you guys. I hope it wasn't too long and I know I got a lot of stuff. I'm just ready 
to store all this stuff away and not see it in my living room anymore because I had to do this haul so I couldn't really put it up. And I'll be doing some videos very soon in regards to our home. I know a lot of y'all been asking, where's the house videos? Where's the DIY videos and all that stuff? They're coming along. We just have to get settled first. Um, I still am like finding stuff that I'm like, oh crap, I forgot I had this. Or where is this? And where is that? So we're definitely settling in. You know, we've been here for two weeks and it's been amazing so far. It's been a blessing. And I just want to thank you guys for your patience and understanding during this time because normally I do upload videos a lot often, a lot more often than I am now. So I definitely appreciate you guys and I promise you guys won't be disappointed when I start putting out the videos for the DIYs and the home videos and all that. You guys will love them. So if you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that little subscribe button down below and you guys will be notified anytime I upload a video and you guys will not want to miss them, I promise you. So if you're into home decor and organization and budget and recipes and just lifestyle videos, definitely hit that red button down below. And also, if you're new, make sure you leave a comment down below. We are very friendly here. I will definitely write back to you and welcome you to the family because we're a little family here. So like I said before, on Snapchat, you guys get a lot of sneak peeks of what I'm filming or how my house looks so far. So make sure you follow me on Snapchat and Instagram because I do tend to give you little sneak peeks out there. So thank you guys so much for your love and support. I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye.